What's up guys, this is Max Simplifier. Today I'm going to show you a very important video regarding a virus called as the IKE virus, I-K-E-E -E virus. This virus has been recently spreading around all over the iPhone devices. I'm not sure whether this virus exists for the other iOS devices, but I'm pretty sure it's there for the iPhone. Before I get started, I'm going to show you first that, uh, or tell you first, that the this IKE virus results in the premature connection error between CyberDuck and the iPhone every time you try to make a connection. So I'm going to show you in this video how can you remove uh, the iKey virus from your iPhone and at the same time make a successful connection between the iPhone and CyberDuck. So here I am going to open the iPhone, unlock the screen. Once there, I have to go to Cydia and install iFile from there. But since I already have it installed, I'm going to directly jump to it. Here it is, iFile. Once there I'm in the iFile, make sure that you are at this location, okay? And then we're going to get started deleting files. There are two files that we've got to delete. Actually, those files are not the virus. Those files are created by the virus, but once they are deleted, they will not be created again. So, considerably speaking, it is as if you have removed the virus, but truly, you haven't removed it completely. So, the first file is going to be at the bin. You go to bin. And then you search for a file called as search for a file called as POC BBOT. That's the file, the highlighted one. Once you search for it, you're going to find it over here. You delete it. Obviously, I'm not you're not going to find it on my iPhone now because I've already deleted it. Next is this file, com.ikey.bbot.plist. Now to go to this file, you have to go to system, and then you have to go to the library. And then you have to go to a folder uh, called as Launch Daemons. Launch Daemons, Launch Daemons. Where is it? Yeah, here it is. Launch Daemons. Once you go to it, you're going to search this file, com.ikey.bbot.plist. You're going to search it over here. And once you've found it, you're going to delete this file. Okay? Once this file has been deleted, now press the home button. And then uh, all that you've got to do now is simply reboot reboot your iPhone once it has been rebooted like this you have successfully removed uh, those files that has prevented the connection between the iPhone and CyberDuck that are created by the virus and as I have said they will not be created again by the virus so considerably it is as if you have removed the virus but to be honest you haven't completely removed it however till now I haven't faced any other problems with this virus but if you're interested and you want to know more about this virus, and if you want to know how did it end up on your iPhone, then you're going to find a video link in the description below. Go to it and you will know how. Uh, well, that's it for removing the virus. Now what we've got to do is as follows. We have to go to CyberDuck. Once you go to CyberDuck, you say open connection. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Before you do that at CyberDuck, on your iPhone, after rebooting the device, you go to Cydia. And then you search for open SSH, okay, to reinstall this file again, right from Cydia. Once it has been reinstalled, then you go to CyberDuck on your Mac, enter over here your iPhone's IP address, type over here root, the password A-L-P-I-N-E, okay, uh, all of them small letters. And the port should be 22, and then you press on connect, oh, and change this to SSH file transfer protocol, press on connect, and like this you can successfully transfer uh, SH files right onto your iPhone from CyberDuck and make sure they are both the Mac and the iPhone connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Well, that's it for this video. Please read and subscribe and if you have any comments, leave it below.